Well, I'd like to welcome everyone here this morning to uh, help us dedicate uh, the Maestro. And it is appropriate that, we, that it's called the Maestro because it's housed right here at the Victory, uh, which is also home of the Evansville Philharmonic Orchestra. This is a wonderful steel sculpture that's the work of our local artist, Timothy Fitzgerald. Yes. It was purchased by a longtime Evansville resident and a collector of local art, Carol Carruthers. When Carol moved to St. Louis, she donated the Maestro to the city in honor of her, of her friend, the late Shirley James. I would also like to thank the Evansville Public Art Commission for approving the placement of the Maestro here in Victory Theater. Their continued efforts to highlight the arts and improve the quality of life here in Evansville is greatly appreciated. Uh, also, thanks to the City of Evansville and industrial contractors who assisted with the installation of this work of art. And now, I'd like to introduce Reed Eikamp, who is the current chairman, uh, chairwoman of the Public Art Commission. The Public Art Commission wants everyone in the community to appreciate the many pieces of public art that we have. And by having this piece in the Victory, it's just another way as people enjoy things in the Victory Theater, they can enjoy public art along with it. It's good to have the city recognize uh, my art and local artists' work. It's important for the arts, for this economy, you know, they're going to really have the type of art. So help support your local artists and help support the Victory. Thank you, Jim. You're welcome.